Jefferson City Police will increase patrols this Halloween. A grant from MoDOT will pay the overtime for officers. KOMU 8's Christine Slesser spoke with residents at the capital city to get their thoughts. Police force will especially increase in residential areas where there are more children. With an increased number of people on the streets, we're going to increase our officers, uh, and particularly our traffic officers. Smith says parents need to watch their children closely on Halloween because kids get too excited and forget their safety. You get to walk around and dress up and you get to get candy and all that. Residents think the increase is a good idea. Well, if they're going to patrol um, for intoxicated drivers, the, you know, the kids at trick-or-treat definitely would be safer. The risk to, uh, to especially kids, is probably pretty high. There's probably also a risk of uh, property damage, too. If I'm with an adult or parent or a guardian, I think it's very safe. Police encourage children to wear reflective clothing, carry a light source, and never enter a stranger's house. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration reports more than half of highway fatalities across the nation on Halloween 2008 were due to a driver with a blood alcohol content above .08. Christine Slusser, KMU8 News, Jefferson City. Meantime, Columbia police officer Benny Cook spoke with members of the Broadway Christian Church about keeping kids safe Saturday night. He says, make sure kids know the area well and keep a grown-up close by. If you would like more Halloween safety tips, go to our website, KOMU.com.